Hey, welcome to Select Arcane! On Christmas morning, we awoke to multiple presents under the tree, the lights glimmering, and the true feeling of Christmas was felt. I'm sure as most families do around the world, we had a great breakfast of French toast and maple syrup, and proceeded to open the presents that were under the tree, very likely placed by a jolly man in a red suit. As my family spread out, we had multiple gift opening sessions at multiple locations, all throughout Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. And a lot of laughs were shared and a lot of presents were open, wrapping paper flying everywhere, of course. And of course, the dogs needed their Christmas presents first. And when all was said and done, there was one more box that was under the tree. And lo and behold, it was for me. About three hours from here is a magical workshop that one of the most kind and wonderful model horse painters lives. I, of course, speak of Snowdrift Studios Lynn Castles Caldwell, a local to my own Region 11 and one of the most talented artists I've ever met. With the box open and magic flowing out, sitting neatly on top is a pouch that I had sent out. Carefully pulling it out, something is wrapped in a blue cloth. And unfolding that, it's a base, which makes me, of course, want to pull out the horse in post haste. Gleeful and giddy, I dig through the peanuts looking for my treasure. But before I get to that, I instead find a letter. Well, actually, a business card, a sticker, and a keychain. Thanks, Lynn. With more pawing and digging, I finally find what I'm looking for. A pony I have wanted forevermore. Inside the pouch and under all that wrapping is the most beautiful roan, a color I have never shown. Very carefully, I unwrap her delicate head and just in general make sure not to break her. And all the rhyming aside, isn't she the most beautiful Christmas present to have ever graced the underneath of a Christmas tree? This excited Mustang mare was sculpted by Sue Kern, also known as Sakari Customs. Sue's sculpts really dynamic and very unique sculpts, so it's no wonder that this mare is so cool. I asked Lynn to paint this mare a color I don't have in my collection. An artist's choice, Chestnut Roan. I know Lynn could pull it off because she's the queen of dapple greys and roans. And wow, this mare is packed with unique details. Because this mare looks like she's a wild Mustang, I really wanted her to be a BLM Mustang. That means Bureau of Land Management. They're the governing body who looks over the overpopulation problems and general welfare of the Mustangs. A little controversial, I know, but, but we'll skip over that part, right? It's Christmas after all. Because of this, I wanted her to have the BLM traditional freeze brand. That just means that she was a rounded up Mustang who was brought into captivity and, you know, kind of gives her identification. Like a thoroughbred's lip tattoo. Here's an excerpt from Lynn. It means US government, 2017 approximate year of birth. 1221 registered number. For some reason, I see her as a four year old. And Lynn, I definitely agree. I think she's around four since she's so lanky and seems to be growing into herself. Lynn also mentioned that she got this reference for the horse from some Mustang in Arizona. So with that information, I'm just going to assume that this mare was rounded up in the badlands of Arizona, and I'm just going to go with that for her backstory. And because of that, I'll be naming her Sedona, as in Sedona, Arizona. The city is famous for its picturesque vistas and its amazing red rock formations. It's definitely on my bucket list to check out. Also, I should note that I'm no stranger to Lynn's work. I also own this beautiful Superlumina 2 by Maggie Bennett, painted by Lynn. She's famously known as the Bad Mare, and I really hope Sedona puts a good influence on her. So here we have the Good Mare and the Bad Mare. Thanks so much for watching, and thank you so much, Lynn, for this amazing pony. I can't wait to show her at our local shows when we get to see each other again. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. Tell your friends about it. Find me on Instagram. Find me on Facebook. You know where to find me. And I'll see you next time. Thanks, everyone. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year.